Hey there, how's everybody doing today? Thanks for joining me for day 12, y'all. Today's poem is called Words and Thoughts. Am I the only one who prays for God to help me control my thoughts, mouth, and actions? Doubt it. And daily, am I the only one who prays that God will help the confusion that riddles in my heart and mind? Daily. <laughs> I'm sure I'm not alone. Today's poem, again, is called Words and Thoughts. Um, just a few little passages real quick. Proverbs chapter 3, verse 5. Trust in the Lord with all your heart and do not lean on your own understanding. Luke 24, verse 38. And he said to them, Why are you troubled and why do you doubt? Do doubts raise in your hearts? Jeremiah chapter 17, verse 9. The heart is more deceitful than all else and is desperately sick, who can understand it? Okay. In Proverbs chapter 2, verse 6, the Lord gives wisdom from his mouth comes knowledge and understanding. Words and thoughts. How do I stop these words from my mouth? How do I stop these thoughts from my head? For days I feel totally numb and without emotions. For others, I feel overwhelmed with thoughts. Shall I ever have a balance? Shall I ever be normal? I often wonder what normal really is. Will I stay confused for all my days, or will I break away from my madness? They say we reap what we sow. I must have sown a lot. Can I ever learn to sow properly? Can my life ever find a pattern? We become what we believe. We can start believing in our own lives. Do I mean these words I say? Do these thoughts have truth behind them? I do not wish to lie to myself. I certainly don't want to lie to others. Could I recognize the truth if I saw it? Or could I believe the truth if I heard it? My mind is confusing my heart. My heart is confusing my mouth. Our hearts are what links to God. Our minds, whew, playground sometimes. But we just pray to him throughout the day, not just in the morning or just in the evening, but throughout the day to help us control it. We're all in this daily battle against the evil one. But as children of God, we can go through these trials. He is there to guide us along these times, but only if we ask him to. We've got to first ask him in our heart and then ask him to help us each day. I got faith in all of y'all. Thanks for day 12. I'll see you tomorrow for day 13. God bless.